it's one of those games where Rebellion will be able to move into this mid lane quickly. Let's see, end of the draft, Timbersaw for Zai in the off lane. All right. Something that Shopify can rely on here. As oh. Zai, well, he's going to claim that in the upper level Eidolons. Oh, yeah. And Boxy looks like they should be able to get this one. He's going to throw out the Avalanche, but uh, Saberlight did a nice job here. But also that Swashbuckle is going to be a lot of damage. But the death of Zai. Oh, the death of Zai. I wasn't expecting that to come out of my mouth. And it looks like Insania is going to take a lot of damage as well. Okay, in a little bit of trouble. Nice snowball dodge. He's in a lot of trouble. Sticking on top of him. This tag team's slowing him down so much. Really nice movement there from Crit. Staying in front of the Lina. Now they're going to try and go and save light because the supports are mid. They do manage to kill Nisha, which I think is maybe a fair trade-off for Shopify Rebellion. Well, your crit has managed to get 20 wand charges. So when he comes back down to this bottom lane, he's actually kind of scary. And he's going to put that to the test here. See if he can get off the wand. He can't. Change around this mid lane. They really want runes on both these playmakers. Man, every single time a support leaves one of the side lanes for a moment, somebody goes and pounces. But what yeah, happened to the two man LSA? They finish off the Enigma and crit. Well, with the shard and the idol ones, maybe he can get this kill. It's a close call, but he does manage to pick it up. And now, Ben, that's going to be the key here. Oh, a regen. That would be so big for Nisha if he can hold on to it here. Phase shift is going to be able to dodge one of them. And he has an orb as well. He's going to jump stunned. over to him, but the snowball sticks on to top of him. Abed does manage to hit him with a follow-up. Oh, Nisha, just two deaths in this early game? Did not expect this to come out, and this is huge momentum for Shopify. Absolutely. The Fade Bolts, that'll only delay the inevitable as Abed picks up a double kill. Oh. Yeah, you know, this is a nice edge matchup up here. I mean, I can't believe he fall Timbersaw into a trees. That is just a scary prospect. Bye-bye, Saberlight. This Saber is a high kill duo together for so long. It's designed to do this. Have him roan, enable Abed, and then Abo creates a space for your farmers. That nice edge, a little too sharp for our wheel melter. Yo, Boxy. He was sitting behind that tower like you were talking about. Couldn't really do anything to stop it. Now he's trying to poke his head out. Maybe I can get home. No. No, you can't, sir. He kills some Eidolons for his trouble, but he will eventually fall. And here's the mid-collapse. This has to work for Shopify. If you take this fight and it doesn't pan out, you're going to commit a lot. Oh, they're trying to get some stuns out onto Nisha. They throw so many at him, maybe they can kill him. But the orb, oh, they toss him over to the side. That's awkward, but he can jump over to his orb, so he's going to be fine. John's away. Boxy, nice avalanche on to four. They do have Zai following up. The black hole goes out, doesn't really grab anything, but Liquid's also a little bit low. The coil does manage to help secure two kills, so one for two exchange. Nice, but I'm not worried about you staying alive. Oh. I'm worried about you killing the Liquid heroes here. They defuse a blade pickup, timed with this smoke. They are all so in on killing though. Zai here. It's going to be a tough one, but they might just have him. He wasn't allowed to timber chain away and they do get him. He took just hit coil. <laughs> Centaur chains and sides back and forth with the stolen enchant. Telekinesis. Nisha overextended? Oh, range. Nisha! Oh, that is a dead dead black mid laner for Liquid. And the black hole being used. That's a little awkward, but crit does die. The toss back. Boxy. So he oops him over to Insania, missing the LSA. He's got juke him with the fog. Yeah, tries to go into the pit for a second. Can't oh, the stolen that. black hole. Didn't notice that Insania had nabbed that one. But again, your cores are behind. I don't think you can just force the pit when Nisha can throw an orb. You can throw a fade bolt in there. This tiny blink is coming quicker than you think, especially if you give up your carry on the side lane. Sai has had Arteezy been willing to give it away to other teams very often. In fact, the last time they played it was in the uh, group stage against Geek Slate. We're going to watch him get a get. Oh, nice. stack. Should survive here. Why not so lucky? No. And this is not a game Enchantress can front line. <laughs> Team 3 against Team Secret for that lower bracket final. This uh, fly is going to die once again teams because I'm North American. That's Foxy. You're biased towards everybody. <laughs> Can you blink? No, you can't. Okay. And that's this Roche off Kind of ensures Roche, right? Instant teleport by Zai. He's oh, going to continue run to him. match him. Fly, he's going to be... I don't even know what he is. I was going to say the body to step in front of it, but he just gets blasted so quickly. They're still going to be able to catch up to him thanks to the coil, and he's going to die. Arteezy's go. gone. Point Zai mid, showing Mick a super deep bottom with a skeleton push. Catching Arteezy again. This was a clever move. The coil's going to hold him in place. Not going to be able to rebound over to Saberlight like he wanted to. And Zai even pushing Saberlight and Fifth fly away. Death. Another LSA. Mick a has the attack speed. So you were saying that they 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 baited out the Le they showed the Lena bottom with the Aegis while they made that move right they made Shopify think that they were bottom while they were rotating up to top yeah. Aegis hero bottom Zai their frontliner mid and they're controlling the other side of the map with three man smoke they just not forced Shopify to group up 
may not be uh, in this game much longer as another pickoff from Liquid. It just keeps on going. Shopify cannot seem to show their faces outside of the base for an instant before Liquid immediately pounce. False the problem. <laughs> that is the state of this game, Oh, he's spotted now. Oh, they're going to catch him. Insania is going to get picked off. Aha! But oh, the TP away. See, it's a long TP. Where was Why that was TP long? going, RTZ? Oh, they're going to toss and to break the coil. Just the added bit of flare. By oh, nice use of the toss there. Putting it over to the hard cam creep farther away from his base. This is and just that's so farther Mickey. away from safety. That's just so Mika can farm neutrals. Well, so Liquid well. runs up a ramp blind as five. And okay. you rolling thunder all of them continuously for 10 seconds. You just get the back and <laughs> forth on the... Uh, <laughs> yeah, they oh, got a the two-man avalanche instead with the toss over as well. The pocket's going to take full advantage of that one. Immediately throw the good the Lena. Lena. They do manage to get on top of the Lena, but they force Apple away from that rolling ball and get him a little bit farther away. The snowball rolls on through, but, you know, that's going to be a dead tusk. And now the coil. Okay, nice use there by Abed. Rolling up to be able to get out of the coil. RTZ doesn't have that same kind of magic immunity, though, so Abed is going to be the only real survivor of that team fight. You have to kill two or three heroes in Rolling Thunder. I mean that literally. Yeah. You need this Rolling Thunder to destroy Liquid in some clumped up area. And then that'll set up a black hole on top. Maybe they will find Zai. Got oh, BKB. Got the BKB. Is that going to be enough to save him here? It looks like it and he's only down to half healthy. In fact, he's going to turn around and help. They've got Boxy in with the avalanche. Nisha and Mikame. He's out. To follow they this got up. Him. They do manage to kill the Timber Saw. Yeah. Can they get away, though? Misha's going to make sure that Crit certainly isn't making it up. Fly's going to be tossed back in the LSA as well. So a one for three exchange. Oh, oh maybe a fourth one. That's it. RTZ, that's it. GG out. They got Ty. And then they're done. Hey, they got Ty, though. Yeah. Taught him a lesson. <laughs> Don't try and frontline versus me, son. Take you down with me. I feel like Nisha was more concerned about those deaths than getting a game one victory over Shopify Rebellion. You see that camera shot? Even in victory, he was just like, all right.